While Eliza McCartney withdrew from today's National Track and Field Championships, other names have been made. Borsha Bing's one of them. She only took up 400 metre hurdles a year ago and now has back-to-back -back New Zealand titles. Christina Eddy has her story on her rapid rise. At the Sydney Classic last month, just one year after taking up 400 metre hurdles, Portia Bing was seemingly out of the race with 200 metres to go. Then, pure desperation set in. Being on the inside for New Zealand, she's going to take this one. She's going to get the win. I realised, like, well, you know what? It's pouring of rain, it's cold, you're already so far behind, you have nothing to lose, you may as well just go for it. A New Zealand record of 56.04 seconds, a staggering time considering just two years earlier she'd specialised in heptathlon. It's an event where she peaked placing 16th at the 2015 World Champs, before injuries saw her lose it all. I had my sports going for me, I could travel around the world and I could just do all those things and then it's taken from me very, very, very quickly um, in the matter of like a week or a day. Her sponsorships were cut in a matter of days and Bing was left to re-evaluate her career. I tried to decide if you know, I was doing it because I loved it or if I was doing it for the sake of doing it. Deciding her athletics career wasn't over, she turned to the 400 metre hurdles while also studying law. What a race there by Portia Bing. Her record time in Sydney would have seen her medal in Brussels at the Diamond League last year, a stage she'd like to step up to. Diamond Leagues don't come around every day of your life so if I could get into something like that, honestly that would be huge for me. Bing with the world at her feet as she eyes a rapid return to athletics big time. Christina Eddy, News Hub.